All right, people, this is going to be my review of the Phoenix Light TK11 with a combo with the KZ one inch weapon light mount for the AR 15 mid quad rails. I'm pretty much simple over here Allen wrench to tighten up the clamp, and same on the other side over here to tighten up the mount to the rail. Pretty much just a slide in, you know, gotta take the bolt out before you slide it in and align the bolt with a notch on the rail and go ahead and tighten it up. There it says KZ USA one inch mount. Now I'm gonna show you the new light that I got. It's the TK11 Phoenix light. This one has a rating of uh, 225 lumens on turbo mode and 60 lumens on regular mode. 60 lumens last about 10 hours. The 222 lumens last about six hours, if not, if I'm not mistaken. But I uh, mount that on my AR. Um, let's go ahead and show you how we do this. CR123s, and it can also use the 18650 rechargeable batteries. One module. There we go. That's looks like that's regular mode right there. Can't really tell. I'm gonna do another review in the nighttime. And here is the turbo mode. I don't know if you can even see it. But the beam's pretty tight as most as you can see. Alright. Same click switch and momentary without clicking. I'm gonna show you how I mount it on my AR. Seems pretty plain and simple. I'm gonna take this out, take out this spacer. Seems like a pretty solid light. It's also waterproof to a certain depth. I just slide that on there. The spacer back on. There's a little washer between the two uh, sets of threads for this spacer and the cap. So you just gotta find it and push it in. There we go. Batteries in. Tail cap in. Locked all the way. I usually lock the back with a spacer, thread it back to it, lock the cap on. And you can either push it all the way or not, but I push it all the way. But to unlock it again, you kind of have to unlock the Allen wrench to push it back to able to unlock it. But I'll just leave a little space. Center it out. It's pretty nice. Tighten down. There you go. TK10, TK11, excuse me. KZ one inch mount flashlight on AR15. Now, uh, Phoenix Light came out also came out with a pressure switch for this, which I think runs about twenty dollars. So, let's press it. There we go. TK Phoenix Light TK11 with KZ one-inch flashlight mount on an AR-15 quadrilateral.